It's celebrating a century as another member of the greatest generation turns 100 years old. For this morning's Veterans in Focus, our Greg Chandler introduces us to a veteran who served the fierce fighting of World War II. Take a look. When you consider where Felix Longoria was and what he experienced during World War II, you realize he's lucky to be here on his 100th birthday. Uh -huh. Felix Longoria didn't wait to be drafted into service. He volunteered in 1940 <laughs> at San Antonio's Camp Bullis. Everybody was doing it. He was then assigned to Fort Sam Houston and the 2nd Infantry Division. Then the Japanese attacked Pearl Harbor and the U.S. was at war. Forgot the town. His unit wasn't shipped out right away, skipping the North African and Italian campaigns. Instead, Longoria went to Northern Ireland to prepare for the invasion of Western Europe. On June 6, 1944, Longoria was among the second wave to land on Omaha Beach. He survived without a scratch. From there on, we went up to... In, in, uh, uh, France. From there, Longoria and the 2nd Infantry Division fought their way across France. We got to the little town. We had to wipe it up. So we fought for it. And we just kept on going. His luck was tested in the town of Brest. Longoria was wounded, shot in the arm. He rehabilitated in England and rejoined his unit just in time to go to Belgium. The Germans came over. And they whip us up good. That was the Battle of the Bulge, right there. where Longoria was wounded in the knee. The U.S. would win that battle, and eventually the war. And even though Longoria can't tell the stories with the details he used to, and I wish I could have done more, but <clears throat> sometimes I just forget. His service helped defeat the Nazis and free Europe. Longoria also served in Czechoslovakia during the war. While he was there, he helped liberate a Nazi concentration camp. When we spoke last week, Longoria said turning 100 doesn't feel all that different. For Veterans in Focus, Greg Chandler, Chris 6 News. Oh, and happy birthday. Now, Longoria's family and friends celebrated his 100th in style on Monday. The Corpus Christi Veterans Band provided the music as well-wishers gathered outside Longoria's home. Claiborne County Commissioner Jerry Martinez presented him with a quilt of honor Mayor Paulette Guajardo stopped by to say a few words.